stay to be neighbors would you be mine would you be mine it's a wonderful day in the neighborhood a wonderful day to be neighbors would you be mine oh i was gonna go down and see erica but i'm seeing um a lot of vests walking around i don't know if i could get to them in time though uh, there's one coming towards me though safe journey happy space traveler safe journey safe journey Wow, got some old folks. It's a wonderful day in the neighborhood, a wonderful day to be neighbors. Would you be mine? Would you be mine? It's a wonderful day in the neighborhood. Good evening, beautiful day, isn't it? Have a good night. Yeah. Thank you. Wow. Wow. We achieved conversation. Yes. We achieved conversation. Okay. Now I can go down and see Erica. But I'm going to let that lady get to where she's going because I don't want it to look like I'm just going to stalk her. Because we don't commit crimes, do we? No, we do not. Let's go find Erica. That girl works harder than any of us. Let me tell you something. She doesn't even have a channel. But she's out here, as far as I know, every day of the week. And we're talking for like four or five hours at a time. So, um, check out her website, endscientology.org. Give her all the clicks and views you can. And she doesn't even know websites can get sponsorships. I'm like, duh, don't you know that's how websites make their money? So uh, I would like to see her get enough traffic that she could get, she could get sponsors on that page. That would be amazing because she's put a lot of work into it. It's not flashy, it's just facts. Just the facts, ma'am and sir. When it, uh, whales? Well, wow, you're a long way from Clearwater, darling. I supposedly have a, a Welsh ancestor here or there. Hello, friends. Hello. Have a wonderful day, beautiful evening. You don't stream, you just yell loud. Diana, Diana, hello. And it's Lynn from Wales. I'd like to make a trip in June when I'm off school. Well, come on, girl, come on. Pull an SP supporter. Hey, darling. She did smile, finally. At first, it looked like she was just going to keep her head down and ignore me. And I think she thought, uh, oh, man, they're just not closing. I should have bolted right in there. But I thought it was way too late or i would have gone stealth oh that's interesting yeah. blinds tack on its way down deploy blinds tack do i first off let me let's get a good look at the website i was bragging on you on my way over here so yes i have completed the atari rundown Woo! I saw that when I was coming up. Run around that pole. Run around that pole. Now I have something else to show you. Okay. I'm really excited about it. It's coming up. Yeah. Lynn, uh, no, not Lynn. Uh, biscuits and Groovy. Why Scientology? What? I need, I need, uh, I need some, some verbs and additional nouns in that sentence to know where you're going. You know where I'm going? No, just why Scientology? That's what somebody said. Why Scientology? I'm like, why do we protest them? Oh, um, yeah. Like oh, oops. Did you forget something, sweetheart? 
Well, I'll wait for you when you get back. It's okay, I'll wait for you, darling. Okay, so you know how they have to come through here? Mm-hmm. And then they have to kind of go through here? Mm-hmm. <gasps> Let's go see Sign Tech. Let's see how long it is before they steal it. No, it's been up since five. Wow. Total freedom happens when you leave Scientology, sbtvfoundation.org, 727-266-5797. That's amazing. Let's see the other side. Queen, I told you all, she's queen of sign tech. Scientology needs a .org to help its members escape, sbtfoundation.org. Gorgeous. It's, it's right here, like, even if you don't walk through here, you have to look at it. Right, right, right. Nice. Wow. That's awesome. All right, let me catch up on chat. I was uh, reading and then we got into conversation time. Yeah, didn't she do a good job? Versus say the Catholic Church. Well, um, the Catholic Church uh, is not uh, trafficking human beings. Wow, that's a gorgeous dog. Oh, there is nothing like a German Shepherd. Hi, gorgeous. Aren't you so handsome? He's as friendly as a Scientologist, huh? There's a Scientologist who I think has a golden retriever, which should not be allowed. It should not be allowed, yeah. Um, Scientos don't, Scientos don't, wait, wait a minute, wait, can't, oh, I think I did something other than live chat. But, uh, but darling, if you've got a beef with the Catholic Church, by all means, you know, exercise your, your right to freedom of speech. They have covered up a lot of sexual abuse. They have definitely covered up a lot. And I think we as a society are much more aware of the potential issues there. Hey, Butterfly. Um, uh, Fuzzy Pink Handcuff says, hi, Lori and Erica. Hi, Fuzzy. I guess Retired Red is in chat. Hey, oh, there she is. Hey, Red. Uh, it's Freezy New in chat. Uh, Unstoppable SP. Hey, darling. Uh, there he is. Oh, he's at work. Hey, jump in when you're when you want when you when you can. Otherwise, listen and say hey. All the found, uh, Lynn says found. Indeed, I am found you through Aaron. Yay! Thank you, Aaron. Well, Diana Winkett, we look forward to you uh, coming out and protesting. If not here, then somewhere. I love what you do. Just wanted to know why. Um, you're welcome. Um, it's so I've, I'm a multi-generational Tampa Bay resident and Scientology is just something that's always been in my face. I remember my high school class, uh, a group from my high school class going to a really nice, there's this place on, uh, the, uh, the old Tampa Bay beach, um, just before you cross over the bridge to come to Clearwater, um, used to be called Crawdaddies, and I was so excited to go there because it looked like a giant tiki bar, and I just couldn't wait for this trip. And my parents, specifically my mom, saw the flyer and where it was for, and she said, no, you can't go there. I'm like, why can't I go there? And she said, it's owned by a Scientologist. What? And, yeah. yeah. Uh, the one that the one that was a crawdaddy's is no longer a crawdaddy's. It's got a different name now, so I don't know if it's yeah. But that one that's like that looks like a tiki restaurant that's right on the water. That was that was a crawdaddy's, and that was supposedly owned by a Scientologist. And my parents wouldn't let me go. Um, and of course, I understand that now, but I didn't then. So I even as a young teenager. I remember asking my mom to take me and drop me off at the Scientology quote unquote church uh, because I wanted to um, I wanted to infiltrate and expose. I was a little kid. I mean, I was like maybe barely in high school, um, like right out of junior high. Um, and so, yeah, I wanted to take them down. Even I was like 14. I wanted to take them down. So it's, uh, it's kind of um, sort of been a lifelong ambition, honestly. And probably with this particular cult, it's simply because it's been in my face my entire life, just because, you know, my family's been here for many generations. So we were, we were here when they came ashore and started taking over Clearwater. 
I hope that answers your question, sweetie. You're a preacher's kid. You hate all. Now, see, I um, I uh, I grew up in a Baptist church. I have a relationship with God, but I don't consider myself to be a religious person because to me, religion is corporation, corporate, and um, to me, uh, faith is a it's a personal belief. Um, and I don't need the dictates of someone deciding what I can and cannot do. So I, obviously I wouldn't have been a very good fit in Scientology, would I? <laughs> because they need people that will be pliable to all their orders. And that's not me. But, uh, oh yeah, make that, quick, make that quick turn around, darling. I saw you dip. I saw you dip, darling. And if you come down the other way, she's going to come down this way. She's gonna come down Gaslight Alley. We have to be very, very quiet. We're on a, we're on a squirrely. We're on a squirrel mission. We're on a squirrel, squirrel mission. We have to be very quiet. Very quiet. Y'all, there's some, there's some 2D, 2D outflowing here with the birds. No, they're fighting. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. No, sir. No, sir. Leave them be. Oh, they're fighting over the girl. They're fighting over her. I don't care. You're not going to, you're not going to do it in front of me. No. You're not gonna kill another bird just so you can mate. No, sir. No, sirs. No, sirs. Sorry, I know it's your way, but you did it right over my head and it's not gonna happen. 2D outflowing. Be nice. Okay, so obviously she's not coming this way. She went another way, so we don't have to whisper anymore. We could walk up this way and see what's going on. Hello, darling. It's beautiful this time of day on this little pathway here. Ah, uh, yep. Battle of the strongest gets to mate the female. I thought they were going to pierce my eyeballs, though. I'm like, thank goodness I have glasses on. Safe journey, happy space traveler. 
Safe journey! Safe journey, happy space traveler! Safe journey! Okay, let's catch up on uh, chat before we go back. We'll go back to see Erica again and then we'll head to Superpower. And you wascally wabbit, I saw what you did the other night and I thank you very much. You were very generous and you're so sweet. Oh, do we have dust in here causing a ruckus? Dust and soda fountain! Used to live in Temple Terrace. You know, I started my career there. I was a Temple Terrace PD before I went to Hillsborough County. You're gonna stay with your ex-husband's wife? That sounds like a conversation starter right there. No, I was, there was, um, there was a, a Scientoe that was like walking up this way and it looked like she was gonna walk all the way over to where we were standing, but she saw me, come on. And then she took a sharp turn this way. So I thought she was trying to get to the bank building, which, which is where the information uh, center is. So I assumed she was gonna walk up through Gaslight Alley and then go in the back door. So I was, uh, yeah, I was, uh, I was waiting for her, but she didn't come. So I'm sure that they, the camera is on the bank building. Let her know I was there. Hello. Hi there. Hi there. Hi. Nice car. It's very nice. Very nice car. You're so friendly, sir. So friendly. C-O-C-R-E-8. Anyway, um, but then while I was waiting for her, I did see a squirrel running across the street. And then I was dive bombed by two male birds uh, fighting in the presence of a female because uh, Somebody wanted to and they had to fight and whoever won gets to Trudy Flo. Gets to, you know, go out to D with her. And they already had a nest waiting up there. See there's a nest right there. I can't wait to play it back and see if you could see them charging right down on my head, though. Hi. Check it down, check it down, check it down, down. Go. I'm gonna see if I can get a, let's see if I can get a tracksuit. Hang on, ready? Here we go. I want a tracksuit. I want a tracksuit. I want a tracksuit. Oh, my gimbal just died. It didn't die, but he just went all freaky. He went all freaky on me. There. Where's my tracksuit? Okay, catch up on chat, and we're going to go to Superpower. <sighs> yeah, this would be a great weekend to come out. I'm excited, too. The, I'm worried, though, Dustin, because I'm supposed to meet friends at Disney on Sunday. And I don't want to miss anything. So, i got to pay for those tires. Well, luckily, that hasn't been the case again. Um... But I appreciate the gas money though. I'll tell you that. They're distracting me from my mission. Yep, so uh, yeah, I was for six, almost six and a half years, I was Temple Terrace Police Department. Going down to Superpower. Okay. Clang, clang, clang went the trolley. Ding, ding, ding went the bell. A zing, zing, zing went my heartstrings. From the moment I saw you, I fell. <sighs> I was late getting here. Um, I'd had, a, had some stuff I needed to drop off at my daughter's apartment. She was uh, like probably 15 minutes away from here. 
and uh, I get there knocking on the door and it's not letting me in. Finally, I call her and say, let me in. She's like, oh, I'm checking out at Publix. She said, I thought it was later when you come. I'm like, no, I, I'm usually starting my stream about 6.30. So she uh, said, well, I'm checking out and it'll, I'll be there five minutes after I'm done checking out. So I waited around there and then of course, had to hang out with them for a little while. So I didn't get here till a couple minutes after seven. So I'm late tonight. I'm late, I'm late for a very important date. No time to say goodbye. Hello, I'm late, I'm late, I'm late, I'm late, I'm late. Anyway, I ran around a pole. So I want to know where my chalk suit is. <clears throat> Maybe I should run around a pole at, in front of flag. Maybe they'll be more apt to give me my track suit if I do that. <laughs> Gotta go cook dinner and... Okay, keep me playing. Um, yes, I'm going on the cruise. I am rooming with my dear friend Lydia Von Stretchclaw. Oh, Farrell Cheryl's the best. Love her. She's like my sister from another mister. Fourth graders need their Mrs. Johnson. Yes, they do. Erica is a badass. She's She works harder than any of us out here. She truly does. Dang, a little bit in a time. Now I'm thirsty. Safe journey, happy space traveler. Oh, he's full. Is he going to the coachman? It says coachman. Oh, oh, here we go. We're on a mission. We're on a mission. We're on a mission. Now watch him go to the garage. See if he goes left and comes up the alley. He's turning left. I'm gonna pretend like I don't know what he's doing. Okay. Can you go up the alley? Where's my pole when I need it? taking them now. Hi, I see you. Hi, darling. Mwah, mwah. Much love. Much love. Oh, look at the sunset starting. That's funny. They're so terrified of a stupid cell phone. My Lord. It was full too. Man, that thing looked like it had every seat full. Hey, hey at least I'm working off that little tiny Hershey chocolate bar I ate today. I mean, it was like one of those little bunny things. It was like two inches tall. But still, I feel like crud after eating it. Okay, we don't know where he went. Hi, buddies. Hi, my kindred spirit. Speaking their language.
sorry I don't have any peanuts. Oh, look, it's their love call. Where is he? I have three here. I'm like Mary Poppins of squirrels. Okay, gotta try again to get back to superpower. Their bus tech keeps bringing me back over here. <laughs> oh, <that's> so funny. <laughs> so, I, uh, I was about halfway between the block, between the road in front of Coachman and the road next to Superpower, and a full bus came that said Coachman. So I'm like, safe journey, blah, blah, blah. And I turn and start walking back this way. And of course he elects, instead of turning into Coachman, to go down the sideway. So I just, I'm kind of, like he turns up the road here instead of, okay, so, so I'm just casually walking this way. And as soon as he gets to the next block and turns, turns back um, this direction, I hold butt up there and go up the sidewalk and I'm waiting at the alley. And here he comes right next to me. He literally drove like three feet away from me. And I'm like, same journey, blah, blah, blah. And then he just leaves. He doesn't even he doesn't even let him off. He just took off and did a big circle. I don't know where he ended up. I and mean, he may have dropped him off all the way at like Sandcastle or something, making him walk all the way over. Because he he turned that same direction again. I thought he might go down to the garage and drop him off and make him walk. Which the thing is, does it make sense? Because then I mean we can't walk into their parking lot and get in their face. But if they drop them off at a garage or something, they might literally have to walk steps away from me instead of just in a bus steps away from me. They make zero sense. What's that? What, what about the backside of flag? No, he turned back up this direction again. He just didn't come up the alley. So the only thing I could think of is that he went to Osceola or Sandcastle. Are you okay? Are you gonna die? <laughs> really? I wish I had been here. Uh -huh. And you have control of the intersection. But yeah, you have control of the intersection. So she's like, she's talking, and I'm like, oh shoot, I'm not She's like, yeah, you hate Scientology, yes. But I'm already out of her way. Like I do this kind of thing to show unconscious. Yeah. Right, right. And her car is not... Fine. Wow. Like, oh, you're such a badass. Okay, Scientology driver. Flonk. Flonk. Redo. TRs in. Get your TRs in. Okay, I'm going to try again to get to superpower. <laughs> try not to get killed. I might show up down there. Beautiful. All right, see you in a bit. Got a sunset coming on, y'all. Okay, we'll get down there eventually. Uh, let me s hey, Nana. Okay, uh, th there, there is some, there is a controversy here. Is it Nana or Nona? Because I could have sworn I heard you say, safe journey, happy space travelers. Nana, when I was apparently erroneously calling you Nona. I mean, when you look at the double N, I'm thinking Nana. Okay. Whew. So hello to you. Question, do you have 
Red squirrels in Florida? No, we don't. We just the the grays, brownish gray, grayish brown, whatever you want to call it. Uh, Poe, let me know you and Chad's summer plant. Po oh, you're talking to Poe. Okay, never mind. Cause I was gonna say Poe didn't know my summer plant. <laughs> Sandy, hello. Hello, darling. Dustin, you want Poe to autograph your shirt? <laughs> hey, I was running, Poe. I was running. Afraid of an old lady with a cell phone. Operator, I'm so sorry. But there's an old lady at my door, and I think I'm gonna die. She's got a cell phone, cell phone. She's got a phone. Bow, bow, bow. She's got a cell phone, cell phone. She just went live. Can we get a shout out for Peace Memorial Presbyterian Church for refusing to sell their property to the cult of Scientology? Shout out, Peace Memorial. Woohoo! I thank you, Mindy. Safe journey, happy space traveler, utility man. Oh, they're bounding. The fans are. Safe journey, happy space traveler. Safe journey. Okay, let me get let me get the answer so I know to call her the right name. Okay, so it is Nona. It's a long O. Nona, Nona, boss. Spelled the Italian way. Gotcha. Okay. Then now we know. Y'all, I've been running around poles today where, where I could because um, those are some good looking, good looking track suits and I would like to have my own track suit. So I've been running around poles and thinking maybe they'll give me one if I run around uh, the pole enough. Safe journey, happy space traveler, safe journey. Go on with your bad self. There's some poles over here. We can run around these poles. Oh, I don't think that's legal, y'all. Clearwater doesn't allow you to ride golf carts on the streets of the city. Not a Scientologist. Ooh, boo -doo, boo -doo, doo. Oh, see a lot of poles to run around. Okay, here's the light pole. We can run around this light pole. <laughs> the heck was that? Yeah, I'm gonna wear a tracksuit. Ready? Here we go. I'm gonna run around the pole, see if they'll give me a tracksuit. Ready? Here we go. We're running! We're running! Running around the running around the pole! Going for that Scientol tracksuit! Running around the pole! Woo! Tracksuit! Tracksuit! Where's the tracksuit? Hey! Tracksuit! Can I have a tracksuit now? Can I have my OT tracksuit? Running around a pole! Y'all! Y'all saw me running around the pole! Can I get my tracksuit now? Get on my tracksuit, please. I ran around your pole. I ran around it. I ran. 
around it, the pole for a tracksuit. Okay, pleasant conversation, y'all. The kings and queens of conversation right here, ladies and gentlemen, right here at the Cult of Scientu. Yes. Um, if anybody played back my last video from Friday night, if it looked a couple, a little jumpy in a couple of places, it's because YouTube dinged me for a couple of songs that that uh, they were blasting out illegally. Sandcastle, safe journey, happy space traveler, safe journey. Yeah. So uh, instead of sharing my puny revenue with the copyright owner. I just nixed out a couple minutes here, a couple minutes there. So if it looked like it skipped something a couple of times, it's cause it did. Oh, big truck Scientho. <sighs> I think I've worked off that chocolate by now. Xenu eggs. <laughs> does look like a great well i asked aaron if he wanted me to stop by the pd and ask if we could bring a little uh, barbecue thing um he said he didn't think we would be there long enough to have a barbecue so but he he is talking about having some like folding chairs and just sitting around having a little uh little uh, meat down there. Can you believe sometimes I don't know where my cell phone is? Uh, no, not at all, because I frequently have to have somebody call me so I can find my cell phone. Okay, I'm caught up. I've run around two poles and still no tracksuit. I feel like it's a myth. <clears throat> Safe journey, happy space traveler. Safe journey. Safe journey. Oh, what is the interesting, it's all about me parking spot. Yeah, Mr. Beamer, it's all about me parking spot. Happy course! Happy course work, sir! I wonder if one of those birds finally killed the other one so he could mate tonight. So he could uh, go out 2D with a beautiful femme bird. Boy, they were fighting hard too, though. This place is dead now. How's it going? Oh, friendly. Not going inside. Oh, where's this guy going? We haven't checked in with the garage in quite a while. Safe journey, happy space traveler. Oh, maybe he's not a space traveler. No, wrong van. Space travelers don't wave. I'd say I go check and see if they have any attendance at the garage these days. I think uh, our presence has made them decide that they don't really need to have a booth attendant at the garage. But I honestly probably haven't been down there in like a month. I've driven past it a couple of times and couldn't see any indication that there was someone there. Let's see what it's looking like over here. Oh, empty, empty, empty. She's got a 
cell phone, cell phone. She just went live. <clears throat> Well, that's a lot of pretty bird tunes tonight. I, I hope y'all can hear all the bird songs because they're quite lovely. Well, that's a mockingbird, so he ha should have all kind of pretty songs. Florida State Bird. Okay, are you going to be that way? You really going to be that way? Oh, I don't like pickled anything, by the way. I just happened to accidentally bring Chad up. Car Karine, hello. How are you, darling? If pickled eggs are pickled, then... A few days ago, I went to Chick-fil-A and ordered a Chick-fil-A sandwich, no pickle. And of course, it had a pickle. Two pickles, actually. And the thing is, you could take the pickle off, but then the bread is still soaked with pickle juice. So I had to basically get a napkin and dig out half of my bun. Okay, somebody just went in. You love pickles? Oh, Brian, how could you? And listening to birds, I oh, have such pretty songs. Birds are happy this time of night. First thing in the morning and last thing before dusk. It seems to be when you hear the prettiest songs. Yep, nobody's there. No one there. Ding dong, the witch arrived. Here I am running around the poles. Ding dong, the witch arrived. Here I am running round the poles. Ding dong, the witch arrived. Here I am running around the poles. <sighs> There's a song for everything if you just listen hard enough. <sighs> Getting a workout tonight. Chasing buses, running around poles. Should we go in the police department and ask about using chalk? I, it's right at the, I mean, the entrance is right around the other side of this building. Why the heck not? Although I didn't intend to have their ordinance written out when I came to ask them. But it would be nice to be able to do some chalk art um, this coming week. They'll buzz you in. They'll buzz you in. You could go in there. Oh, this stuff smells so good. Oh, that smells good. Homeless outreach. Okay. Hope it's working. Hope you have a desk sergeant or a desk deputy that's available. See if they have a problem with the camera. Closed. Well, dad, heck, gummit. All right. Why is the door unlocked then? Dad, gummit. Okay, that's what, that was my dad's thing. Dad, come on! <laughs> Somebody lost their stuff.
wife possessions down the tube. Yeah, unlocked doors. I mean, obviously that section is locked up. Um, but if it's closed to the public, then I don't see a reason to have the outer doors unlocked either. But that's just me and not everyone, and not everyone utilizes the same kind of logic that I do. I'll have to try them early. You know what I should have done while I was there is look and see what time they close. Oh well. Maybe my friendly lieutenant will show up again. I think we left on good terms. <laughs> oh, did that say coachman? I think it did, but I can't run that fast. Well, when I say that, what I mean is I can't run fast at all. I can slowly jog. And it usually does what I need it to do. Hi. Pretty sure I passed her once already. My steps at. Oh, I'm not at steps mode. Wow, my steps suck today. Probably had next to nothing before I got here. Alright, we get across the street and we'll check on some chats. Whew. Pickled quail eggs are nasty. I'd say pickled any eggs. I mean, assuming pickled means pickled. Psych sauced, I will have. Oh, is there somebody named Psych sauce in here? Whoop, there we go. Hello, Powder Puff. Yeah, there is a Psyched Sauce. Hi, Psyched Sauce. That's an interesting name. And here comes Erica. My ex-wife would eat cold pickle stuff. <laughs> Ugh. She did some spicy pickled okra once. It was delicious. Blah. Yuck. My husband now goes around the house whistling your little Davy jingle. That's awesome. Little baby Davy and the fake space Navy. That's awesome. I still need to watch your interview with uh, Cheryl. I was in an all day rehearsal um, Saturday. What's that? No, uh, uh, Nona Boss. She did an interview with. What, did Poe do something with Cheryl? I missed that too. Dang it, I didn't even know about that one. Holy heck, hello, uh, Dark Reaper, Canadian girl, hey. Safe journey, happy space travelers, safe journeys. Hello, friends. Well, dang it, that's too, uh... oh, look. Hi, safe journey, happy space traveler. Safe journey. <laughs> Uh, clang, clang, clang with the trolley. Y'all say hi to Erica. Hi. She says hi. It's such a beautiful night out here. It is really, I mean, the breeze is just enough to keep it from um, getting warm. I mean, I did just wipe a little sweat off my brow, but I've been doing a little extra running tonight chasing buses i did i ran around the pole over here oh i have a question you me to hold your camera do you have time for a question do you have time for a question all right so i was studying your uh, ordinance um the one that has to do with writing on sidewalks and stuff and obviously you know it's anything that's permanent that's criminal mischief that's a crime my question is can we write on sidewalks with chalk that just washes off in the rain or could be hosed off? I'd have to look that up. I don't want to give you the wrong answer. Okay. Yeah. It, it, I'll have to research it to give you a, okay. uh, you know, a good answer. I appreciate that. I mean, I'm retired out of Hillsborough County. I don't want to do anything that's going to oh, be against your, yeah. What year did you retire? 
uh, well, I went, I went off on, uh, I, bro I broke my neck. So I went out in 2011 and in 2012, the state approved my line of duty disability retirement right about the time the sheriff was getting ready to write the, uh, come back to work or you're fired letter. Oh. So 2012 is when I, my, my retirement was official. What district? One. Sioux City? I interned at Hinkshire, so I had a district two. Oh, okay. And I was there from 2008 to 2011. Okay. Yeah, I would have been there then, but just, I rarely went made it out to district two. Yeah. When I started, I was at district three before they split. And I, the, where I live was in district one. So when they split, I just went to district one. So. Yeah, district one was a rough district. But it was fun. Yeah, uh, yeah. You know, I had, um, I, at one time I, I had, uh, I was at Avila, and, which is where Derek Jeter lived before he went out to, I love the oh man, he's a very nice guy. Yeah. I sing the national anthem for them for a spring training game once, and, and, and I had my kids with me because, you know, I was a single mom, and, and they, you know, what else are you going to do? Yeah. And they just, they got to hunt, hang out in the dugout with Derek Jeter while I went out onto the field and sang the national anthem. It was so nice, but I, you know, I... I, three times a week I was at his house on alarms. You have to go around, darling. Go around. Thank you. Um, I hope I didn't mess that up. Um, and uh, I'm like, I just don't feel like I'm doing police work. I don't feel like I'm helping my community in any fashion. Like my so, okay, go, go help your... Yeah, 1090, 1094 comes first. Nice to meet you. Be safe. Well, she left with a... <laughs> she left in a hurry. Her part, she's no. She said her partner's fighting. I'm like, go, 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 go. But she said, I was asking about the chalk. She said, she said I would have to research that because I don't want to give you the wrong information. And I said, well, I, you know, I'm I'm retired, so I don't want to do anything that's going to violate your ordinances. But it's you know, it washes off in the rain or with a hose, so it's it's not criminal mischief because you know there's no and damage know nobody ever exactly exactly but i mean i would love to do that this week with uh everybody coming into town yeah they were talking about that things are different things are different there and i i had been saying for like a month i was going to ask um if we could bring a little a little fire pit little barbecue grill or something um, and I did, I texted Aaron before I came. I said, Hey, do you want me to go down to the police department when I get there and ask about that? And he said, honestly, well, yeah, but I, he said that he really didn't think we we're going to be there long enough yeah. or anything like that. No, I, I don't think he wants to. Yeah. Exit. Yeah. Yeah. He wants to kick back and yeah. enjoy friends. Yeah. Well, see, the thing about the chalk that's invisible, except only when it rains, is that it won't wash off in the rain, which makes it more permanent, which leans more towards the criminal mischief aspect. So I'm not going to do anything that's going to shine any kind of negative light on us at all. So, um, yeah, it'd be funny, but I honestly, I would rather them see it. And if they want to hose it down instead of wait for the rain, they could hose it down instead of waiting for the rain. But it's so temporary that it, it's, it's definitely not criminal mischief, which is the state statute. But could it be a violation of their city ordinance? That's what we have to research. Could have a, th yeah. But so we'll see. Oh, you're right. Well, the ordinance did say streets and sidewalk, so but they're not going to hose down. They're not going to hose down the street, but we still would need to see if Clearwater PD would have an issue with that. Yeah, especially on nice, cool nights like this, we can just lay down on the street and and art away. Yeah. Okay. Um, listen, I, um, I got a late start, so I don't intend to make it a long night. I'm going to take it. You're probably done. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm good with walking back because I'll sit in my car for 10 minutes and chat with people anyway. Yeah. And plus, I'm very thirsty after all the running I've been doing. 
So she actually interned um, at my old job, but at a different district. So she might know some of the same people. I didn't get her name though, so I don't know how I'm gonna, unless she just looks for me at some point. I, when, I, when I approach officers, I don't put them on camera. But if they come to me, I'll put them on camera. Right. It's just a, you know, it's a, hey, it's just a respect thing. Absolutely. <clears throat> yeah, I'm heading back to my car, and we'll have our wrap-up chat when I get there, and I'll catch up on everything that I've missed. <clears throat> to catch up with Natalie, I'm, I'm getting so behind on my SPTV. Yeah, well, I now have two interviews with Cheryl that i got to catch up on. Yeah. Oh, I went over two hours last night. Wow. Oh, you know what? That's... I didn't even know about it. I would have much rather watched that than that Ian Rafalco trash. What, what was that? Oh, he was trashing Aaron. Oh, so really? I was in there. It was like, ended up being a four-hour stream, and I was in there for two of those hours defending him and defending Marilyn. Might as well go this way. I take you. You're parked in the same lot as me, yeah. as usual. Because I mean, they talk before. I know, I know. Well, now I have to watch it. Nobody they coming. Do a really good interview about the cause of surgeons, right? <laughs> right. That. <laughs> so I was trying to get my tracksuit tonight, but <laughs> I just love that you put that on your shirt. It's too big. You know, when you design it on Amazon, you don't know what you're going to get. Oh, you so actually did that on Amazon? Yeah, I, I did all my shirts on Amazon. I didn't know they but even I did got that. I in Tampa now. Okay. So I think, I think he's in Tampa. But, um, Does he do just like one or two? I don't know. I just have his number. Gotcha. And, um, he's a friend of a friend. Uh-huh. So. <clears throat> we had a guy at the sheriff's office that had a side business doing uh, silk screen shirt well, printing. Yeah, this type of overlay thing, it's like really easy and common. So. Yeah. I mean, these are all from China, so I have to wait for them to get on the plane. Oh, wow. And then go through customs in Miami. So it's always two weeks to get them. I did make an SPTV Foundation t-shirt that's on my fourth wall. And I've, oh, got, good. I've got a sample coming for me. And then I did one for uh, Natalie and I did one for Tony. Oh. But um, I didn't know what the font was that they used for foundation. So I just found something that was cl as close as I could find. And meanwhile, I had emailed Jenna to ask her. I mean, she did the website, so I thought, well, she might know. And um, so the, the, like probably three hours, it's very similar, but it's yeah. just not the same. Um, probably three hours after I ordered our samples, um, Jenna answered my email and gave me the font. Oh. <laughs> so I went and I redesigned them ASAP. So... I don't know if my samples are going to be the the new font or the original yeah. ones. Either way, we'll just call them collector's items. Yeah. If it's yeah. <laughs> if it's the old the font. Pilot. Yeah, yeah. Um, Only three in the world. <laughs> um, no, but it, sometimes they're so similar that it. I mean, it's the it's the general impression of it. Yeah. It. Yeah. Yeah. Um, all right. Well. I'm, I'm thinking of skipping tomorrow night. I, like I have rehearsal tomorrow on, on okay. Tuesdays anyway. They have, they have music Tuesday night on, like, I think, I don't know who does the TV. Mm -hmm. That must be pizza. But they have music, so it's really nice out there. Oh, I bet, yeah. And there are more people. But yeah. I'm going to have to skip tomorrow night. I've got to get stuff built. Well, I have rehearsal, regular, regular rehearsal for the Master Crowl on Tuesday nights, and then Thursday night. I have rehearsal for a concert we're doing at the um, Museum of Fine Arts at St. Pete on Friday night. So it sucks that, that those two nights when, you know, so, um, and then I am supposed to be at Disney all day on Sunday. So I've been just tr trying to, trying to urge Aaron to do stuff not on Sunday. <laughs> you know, there's, they're going to be doing something on Sunday though, because okay, well, so, oh, we have to stay in our hotels and in our rooms and in our houses right. on Sunday because Lori's not going to be there. 
<laughs> don't have too much fun. Don't do the barbecue on Sunday. <laughs> yeah. I'll be here Wednesday. Actually, there's somebody who lives in Pennsylvania who's been contacting me. Um, she's got family in Sarasota and she's going to drive. She wanted to make sure that I or somebody would be here Wednesday. She's going to drive all the way over from Sarasota. Um, her husband was arriving on Thursday and she said, otherwise, you know, he could come out with her cause she just really wanted to come out and do this. And I'm like, well, I can't be here on Thursday cause I have a, re a rehearsal. I, I normally am not here on Thursday anyway for a family thing, but you know, that's a hard dress rehearsal. So I can't miss that. Um, so she's going to come on Wednesday. So I'll absolutely be here on Wednesday cause I don't want her to make that trip all the way here and, you know. And nobody be here. Very cool. Very cool. Yeah, we'll bring her down and let her say hi. All right. Yeah, see you Wednesday. Bye, everybody. Bye. <laughs> All righty, my friends. Let's get high and dry. Crank up some air, although it's really nice out tonight. With that breeze, humidity's not terrible. At least if it is, the hum uh, breeze is enough to chill it down let's get this guy off the let's get this guy off the gimbal get us set up to chat with the snitch okay do we really need to listen to uh, Harry made a great Harry Potter tiny right now and caught it. do we really need to listen to the half-blood prince right now I think not all right, let's um, scroll back and chat. See what we've been missing. Tired to, you know what? I should, I, 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 Dustin, you know what? I, man, I even contacted my friends to try to figure out another day to go. And my friend's like, well, um, her son, I'm not gonna say his name. He's got, the, uh, he's meeting um, so-and-so on this day, and he's meeting his friends on the, and Sunday's the day he has to be with his friend Laurie. I'm like, alrighty then. So it doesn't matter if something's come up for his friend Laurie. Anyway, um, if it were, you know what, I would just not go if it were a matter of missing out on all these people that are coming from literally all over the world. Thank you very much. Um, oh, it's so frustrating. Okay, how far back do I need to go? Okay, birds, I think, I, did I see that? No, oh, no, I haven't got there. We're still on the cooking, we're at night. All right, I gotta scroll back as far as it goes. Wow, okay. Okay, I did, I did see the tracksuit like a boss thing, so, um, at least I didn't miss them. Uh, site came in at the right time. Diana with the pole jokes. Look at you go, girl. Look at you go. <laughs> great place for a picnic. Apparently not a great place for a barbecue, though. Uh, and Dustin, if, if, if you don't get word, I will make sure that you know when stuff happens, even if I'm not here. I might end up doing a half a day at Disney, though, and then driving all the way back. And my chat time back, so I got to go find my spot all over again. Beautiful. Beautiful. Well, come on. Oh, go, to my, go to my chat. My chat won't come up at all now. Live chat. Whew, got it. Whew, crisis averted. I want to rock and roll all night and party every day. I Okay, I got to find my spot again. All right, I spoke to Dark Reaper, interesting character, Mary. Hey, my angel voiced SP. Wow, Mary, I like that. I like that a lot. Mary just might be my new best friend. Do we have a Canadian good girl? I swear, I believe I coined 
the I'm a good girl because I had not heard it anywhere. And I remember one night I said it in a stream. I said, I'm a good girl. And literally the next night I saw somebody in a chat with the, with the username, I'm a good girl. <laughs> I'm not trademarking. I'm not copywriting. I'm not petty. <laughs> if I did pick it up, everyone is welcome to use it. <laughs> well, I think there's a lot of good girls out there. I really do. Does is he not like Denzel Washington Jr., ladies? Is he not? I think he is. Unable to travel and 30 hours from Florida. That's a long time. Sorry about that, Psych. Yep, it's going to be fun. Nona Boss is going to be fun. I've got to watch. Now I've got to watch two Cheryl interviews, yours and Pose. <sighs> well, uh, 1094, 1094 is back up. Um, 1094 is back up. If, if cop says 1024, now I will say that not age, all agencies use the exact same codes, but 1094 is, is a, is a backup. 1024 is I need somebody and I need them fast. It's an emergency. Yeah. There's, oh yeah, we talked about the invisible art. Oh, chalk. Okay. So I've caught, I found my spot. Yeah, she said her her partner was in a fight, so she had to book it out of there fast. She's very friendly. I don't know if y'all were able to hear her, but um, she she'd interned at, at my agency, but at a different district than mine uh, during the time that I was there. So um, you know, we could have crossed paths at some point. My name was mentioned. What? What? Really? I have to go back and wait a minute. You're talking about Poe, Poe and Cheryl? Yeah, I did. That's, I'll have to put that on my watch list. Oh, he already. He also made shirts, Dustin. Okay. Now we have two options, y'all. I have SPTV Foundation shirts, and the profits for that will will be donated to SPTV Foundation. And I, I will include the names of the people who bought the shirts, too, so that the SBT Foundation sees that it's, it's coming from those people and not me. Um, that's cool. I'll, I have to look and see what yours look like, Poe. I don't think she got... Um, I don't think she's got one of Poe's shirts yet. Cause I know she ordered one of mine, and she's got it. She's got SPTV shirts. Um, I don't know if she got those from Aaron's store or I know she bought. She's got the um, yellow tie dye one that she got from Laura's uh, shop. I really want to get one of those, but yellow does not look good on me. Dustin will be here Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday. So basically every day. Well, you know, Dustin, really, you, me, and Cheryl are the only ones that are out here regularly. Um, it's really just, well, and Erica, but I mean, as far as live streaming, um, Erica's out here more than any of us put together. Uh, Atkins in Texas, did I miss you? She said, pop it in for a sec to say hi. Of Scianto. Dang it, that was at 8.12. What time is it? Oh, it might still be there. Probably not. That was only six minutes ago. Sorry, Atkins in Texas. I just saw you. Sorry. Um, Ushi Burmi? Oh, are you in the are you in the the fatherland? Are you from Scotland? Are you in Scotland right now? Oh, Scotland is my fatherland. Are, are you a lad or a lassie? I'll be there in June. In June, I'll be there in, in Bonnie, Scotland. I can't wait. I can't wait. So good. Okay, wait. Maybe she's still here. 
at my age, I need to go to sleep. That's why I'm looking pretty hard at the clock because like an hour is the time I normally put my dog outside and then put her in her kennel and uh, go to my room. Okay, I'm caught up. So you know what that means. So long, farewell. Oh, you're a wee lass. Oh, hello, Dublin. Oh, my bonny lassie. I cannot wait to see Scotland with these two eyes. Cannot wait for that trip. Ten glorious days. Fly into Glasgow and then, uh, and then head to the Highlands. Head to the Highlands, baby. Yeah, I can't wait. 53-year-old wee lassie. Well, I'm 61, so I've got you bit by, bit by a bit of a bit of a time there. Yeah. Well, welcome to my stream. My ancestry says I'm 49%. No, I'm sorry. 42% Scottish. 49% English. Although I'm... I'll, t I'll take the I'll take the Scots in that fight any day. I'll take the Scots in that fight. I'm absolutely gonna love it. I cannot wait. It's just, man, it just feels like going home. You know, if that makes sense. It just feels like it's part of my soul. And it's odd that I don't really feel that way about England. Um, and my ties are apparently a wee bit. Uh, closer there, but uh, Scotland just feels like home to me, so I cannot wait. Uh, sent a text with the John Poe shirt. Okay, I'll look at it. Um, yep. Anyway, I got a I got a forty five minute drive home, so that uh, if I take a super fast shower, I might be able to get to bed sort of on time. Um, thanks for joining uh, joining in with me tonight, you guys. Um, I'm glad you don't think it's odd. I've never, I've never been there, but it just feels like going home, and I just can't wait for it. Be back on Wednesday. I would be more than happy to have all of you uh, join me there, um, and uh, we'll see if we can run around some more poles and maybe eventually get us one of those tracksuits. <coughs> Night, everybody. Have a great rest of your evening. And uh, we'll see you. We'll see you in streams. And if not, then we'll see you Wednesday. Take care, everybody. Mwah. Bye. Love you.